That's Welcome almost like back. Track. Oh my gosh, that's dope, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's Friday, and we wanted to end our fun-filled week with one of our favorite segments, where we weigh in on a few hot topics and also find out if you're here for it or no. Mm. So, okay. one of the first things, like Egypt just said before he went to commercial break. Okay. Fresh Prince. Fresh Prince. Mm -hmm. He okay. just launched an inspired athleisure wear. Okay. Right? Are we here for it? Um, yeah. you know what? I was here for it. I was here for it 20 years ago when the show was really Pop. high. Mm -hmm. You know, but you know, everybody's, all these shows, all these things are yeah. coming back. So I think there's still an audience for it. It was definitely one of the best TV shows yes. sure of all was. time. It sure enough was. And it, you know, I was just talking to somebody about this. I said, if they brought the show back, mm -hmm. yeah. well, uh, clearly they couldn't bring it back with him because he's well beyond that show exactly. now. Like, who would you cast for it? He could be the father. You would think, you oh, could that be, would, yeah, he could be oh. Uncle Phil, because you know Uncle Phil passed away. The Did real he really? Uncle Phil, I yeah. didn't know that. It'd yeah, be dope to see him away. as a father, being fresh prince, and then to the same scenarios yeah. with his son, and be like, yeah. little boy. I was, yeah. I was thinking Chance the Rapper could play him yes, as Fresh Prince, he could. and then what's the kid from Blackish, the oldest son, Marcus Scribner? He could be Carlton. Yeah, he would, mm -hmm. but I'm, here for, I'm here for the clothes, though. <laughs> yeah, especially oversized little sweatshirt, you know, a little throwback. I'm here for it. I wear my I'm husband. here. I'm here for the clothes. I don't know about why he has to be Fresh Prince though to have. His own line. His it own just line. Be Will. Why can't it just be Will Smith? I'm, right. I'm, I, don't, I don't know if I'm here for the jury still out of me being here for it being a Fresh Prince line. Okay, I like it. Oh. But I love Will, Will Smith. Smith's suit no line. Yeah, I mean, he's done many black. Does he have a, a suit line? A, no, I'm saying he could. Oh, right. That, uh, that now, that. But do you think Definitely. people would take him seriously like that? Though? In a suit, absolutely. Yes. More serious. I mean, he's done the Men in Black. He mm. looks. He looks good in a he's suit. Showing up That's it, so That's mm. okay. I'm here for the throwback. But rapper ASAP Rocky is urging more men to embrace nail art, ladies. Mm -mm. This is a big fashion forward thing, and it's recently been a, a habitual thing for men getting manicures in music and fashion. So. In a recent interview with Vogue, he stated, I feel like men should be able to do nail art without feeling feminine. Ladies, do we agree? Are we here for it or no? Or is Screech. this too much? <laughs> Screech! I, listen, I, I, I like a good manicure. Yes, I like a man um, with a manicure. And I have friends who have done, who are men, who mm -hmm. have done like little cross or something like that, maybe one or two fingers. You know, very simple, clean, you know. Um, I'm not opposed to that. But I am not here for Snoopy down to your fingers. Uh, I'm just not here. I'm not here for the smile face. I ain't here for the hearts and stars. I'm just friends. Not. I have some friends um, who are amazing nail artists. Yes. Now that I'm for because an artist is an artist. But I just think that no, it doesn't. I'm old school. Yes. No, I'm old no. school as well. Oh, yeah. You know, it's sort of like you know. I was down for the male purse. They call it a merch. The man yeah. bag. Right? The man bag. I'm still the purse. There, though. I was, <laughs> I was I, down I, I'm for like that. My smooth backpack. I was right, even. I was even okay. Okay with the skinny jeans for men. I'm even still struggling I don't with like the skinny either. jeans. Well, mm -mm. some guys can wear it right. It looks good on some of the guys, but I can't get with this nail art at all. It's nail, just, nail art is enough. Some things are for women. Yeah. Hated it. Mm -mm. Can't wear. I can't have men <laughs> with the huggers on the side of the Oh, I think it's good for men to express himself creatively, but I think nails. I think that should just be left for the women. Yeah, just speak. Your I like expression. a nice man with a yeah. nice clean nail, but no. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. So, moving on. Yandy, a company infamously known for turning not so sexy people into, you know, they little sexy selves. Mm -hmm. They mean worthy costumes, and they've released a new costume based off the college admission scandal. Okay, so just in time for Halloween, the costume reads Mom of the Year, and it's crossed out, and then it says Inmate. <laughs> Ladies, <laughs> what say you? I'm sorry, I'm here for it. That's a phone. I am here. <laughs> Design for sure. Yeah. I like the midriff. It's yes. very cute. It's very Fashion Nova. It's a fool okay. though. Y'all know y'all wrong for that. Okay. All right. So we got one more. So Jordan Woods, she's officially launched her new hair extension line and it's called Easy Locks Hair. Okay. The collection includes three different looks. It's a lace new part and the fringe and the ponytail. And it comes in 17 different hair colors. Ladies, are we here for of it? Of course I'm here for it. Yeah, it's gorgeous. I mean, yes. yes. We yeah. all like a nice little hair piece. Yes. Every last one of us. Change up every now and again. Mm -hmm. Give us a new one. little look. I'm just yeah. amazed that Scandal birthed her whole career. Yes, but she like, took it and she did the she darn did, thing She did, she did the darn thing. I love, no, I love that interview she did with Jada Pinkett Smith, though. I mean, that was a very honest, <laughs> straight away interview. What? You, you, <laughs> Selena. It'd be like, 
And she did all of this from a scandal. Uh, 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 I'm just saying what everybody's thinking. That's it. I'm saying what they're thinking. <laughs> well, she okay. turned her, she turned her frown upside down. She turned her frown, she frown upside down. <laughs> okay, I lied. Okay, I have another one. Okay. So, Kiki Palmer, she drops this song. It's called Sorry to This Man. Okay? <laughs> and it's merchandise. But no, guys, it's inspired by her interview with Vanity Fair. And she talked about how she didn't know who Dick Cheney was. And she was saying, I hate to say it. I hope I don't sound ridiculous. But I don't know who this dude is. And the interview went viral. So now there have been a lot of memes. And now she has this song and this stuff called Sorry for the Man. I think it's dumb. And but she flipped. That's another example I'm of here flipping for it, it on its Not head. She is, wait, wait. Now, she's on. They, they talked about her being on with. Uh, uh, the Michael Strahan show. Yes, she is um, on that now, show. Now, so she's she's on um, a talk show. Yes, and yes. she's acting. And she's and just she's in Hustlers. Singing, she was amazing. She, she was amazing in Hustlers. Amazing yes. in Hustlers. Yeah. But I'm here for that I'm same. Here for it. Sorry to this woman and man. <laughs> My God, today that's funny. Uh, uh, I will be saying that quite often. I like you, Kiki, but that's a big negative. <laughs> no, I'm okay. here for it. You should know who your uh, representatives and everybody are. Uh, <laughs> so I'm, I'm just. I'm but this Cheney is. is He's a little up there in age, and she's a little younger, so maybe she just I mean, didn't he's recognize been all the him. News and all the hunting scandals and all that stuff going on. I'm just like, she says you sorry to this man. At least she apologized. <laughs> she apologized. <laughs> well, we should wear that when we're in an argument with our boyfriend. I'm <laughs> no, sorry to this man. Point to the left and right. Sorry. sorry. I'm sorry. I said it publicly. Right. <laughs> My glasses are getting foggy. I can't oh, mess with y'all. Well, guys, we always want to know if you're here for it. So send us your thoughts on these topics. And feel free to suggest other topics you'd like to see us discuss at Sister Circle TV. Stay with us, and we're going to be right back after these messages. We'll be right back.